Courtney and Ryan here back with your weekly Money Minutes. It's another gorgeous fall day here. We're actually out in Central Park and today is the morning after the midterm elections. Now Ryan, did you have any thoughts about that or anything you want to talk about? I do have some opinions, Courtney. <laughs> <laughs> I always have opinions. Um, yeah, so not a lot of news. The Democrats took over the House of Representatives, which was highly expected. Uh, Republicans still control the Senate. So the question is, does that mean you need to readjust your investment portfolio? Courtney, what kind of strategies are you deploying right now? That's what I want to know. Yeah, and I yeah. think that's really what it comes to, is you don't want to do anything different just because of the noise and the news. Now, what a lot of people have been asking me about is, should I get out of the market? Should I do yeah. something different, especially over the last couple of weeks here leading up to the midterm? But what you really need to keep in mind, it doesn't matter what the results of the election were. It's just a matter of now we know where things are going to be over the next two years. That tends to add a lot of certainty into the markets. Now, historically, how have the markets done after the elections? I know the statistic. <laughs> so I'm glad you asked. Um, yeah, so believe it or not, after the midterm, which we just had, the 12 months out since 1946, 100% of the time, the market has actually been positive. So basically, the odds right now are the market's probably going to do well after this midterm election, regardless of like who's in the House, who's in the Senate. You know, if you're president, Republican or Democrat, it just doesn't matter. Exactly. Yeah. So really odds are in our favor, but at the end of the day, you really just can't listen to all the noise out there. Just make sure you have a plan in place and your investments are going to work no matter what the headlines are in any given day. Ignore the noise. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I couldn't say it better. <laughs> now click on the link below. You guys can subscribe to our weekly content to make sure you guys are up to date on all of your financial needs. And as always, be, be bullish. bullish.